So guys, for the first step, we're going to head over to search and type in services. Click on it. Once we're on this, we're going to click on any service and click on N on our keyboard, which will bring us down to NVIDIA Display Container LS. Once we're on this, you want to make sure that this says running on it, which means it has been started. So you want to right click on it and then make sure that you can click on start, which will then make it running. But if start has been grayed out and it's already on running, you want to click on restart. So guys, for the second step, you want to head over to the link which will be down below in the description and you want to download GeForce Experience. Once you have it downloaded, you want to open it up and it will look something like this. Then you want to head over to the drivers tab. Then you want to make sure that you have the latest GeForce game ready driver installed to your graphics card. Click on check for updates and it will check this for you. So once you install that, you want to reset your computer and then the problem should be fixed.